so i'm doing a little video with with a smile which is basically a clipping veneers company so i thought it'd be a good idea like to show you this i don't usually do promo like in depth but for people like that seen everyone with like nice veneer teeth and stuff like that not everyone can afford it and this is just like a cheaper option but still amazing results so they're not permanent it's literally just a complete mold of your mouth that they do and you can take them in and out which i think is really good so i'm just going to show you a little bit because i thought it'd be good for the people that want a cheaper option but still amazing your lower arch like with the clay and you get the upper arch as well for your clay so i'm going to try and do it on camera i don't know how it's going to work i might be best just doing it and showing you with it on um and then i'll send them off and when they come back i'll show you the results so yeah it's just an amazing option if you want it not permanent like veneers i like you don't have to take that full commitment stage which i know can be quite like frightening for some people so i'm going to show you what comes in the box and how to do it and then once i get them back and they arrive i'll do a video as well showing you like the before and after and stuff like that like it's going to be quite fun but basically in the box you get your trays you... so in the box for the shields you get two pots with two different colors so you get a white one and like a ready pink one and you need to mix them both together like this and it needs to be so that it's one color like it can't be streaky or having a little bits because that complicates things with the mold like you get soft spots in them. So when your moulds are done and you send them off, they won't come back and fit your mouth correctly. So it's really important that you mix this all up so it's one colour. And they say try not to do it for longer than 45 seconds. So literally just get it all one colour. I'm not looking forward to this bit, but basically you roll it into like a sausage shape. I hope it goes right. I don't know how thick to do it, but basically you put it into a sausage shape and then you put it into your mouth. Oh. In, but I didn't put it in like too far and my um, mold didn't come out right. So it was literally when I pulled it out, I went to pull it out thinking I could re-roll it and I couldn't. It was literally like rock. So make sure that you're aligning it perfectly that's not very attractive at all but when you've done that you have two molds that look like this so i'm going to send them off now in the packaging that they come in and i'll wait for them to be sculpted and then i'll come back on when they arrive and show you and then you can decide if it's for you